number one, chapter number two, and chapter number three. Yes, now we will on our new chapter, chapter number four. So let's see what is the name of chapter number four. Addition and subtraction of three digit numbers. Yes, students. Addition and subtraction of three digit numbers. Previously in chapter number one, two, and three. In chapter number one and two, two digit numbers and chapter number two, addition and subtraction of two digit number. So there we have learned about two digit number, how to form two digit number, and addition and subtraction of two digit numbers. In our chapter number three, we have get the information about three digit number, how to form three digit number, how to write three digit number. Place value, comparison, after number, before number, how to put in abacus, right? So now we will on our chapter number four, addition and subtraction of two digit number. Okay. So students, we are starting our chapter number four, addition and subtraction of two digit number with our first main topic. So our first main topic is A D D I T I O N addition. Yes, students. In our chapter number four, addition and subtraction of three digit numbers. Our first topic is addition. Yes, students. Previously, if you are writing, I am taking one example. If you are writing the number ninety. Yes. So you are writing on top tens and ones. So you can say nine tens and two ones, right? In two digit number, you are writing the number like that. But now in our chapter number three, you have learned about how to write three digit numbers. So if I am writing two hundred forty five, right? So here I am writing on the top hundred tens and ones. So we can write here two hundred. H U N D R E D. Yes, students, this is the spelling of hundred. So two hundred four tens and five ones. This way we supposed to write two digit number and now three digit number. Okay. Now moving to addition of three digit number, right? So first of all we are writing with example three hundred twenty one plus two hundred twenty two. Yes, students here.
Now look here on the hundred column. Three plus two. Yes. Keep bigger number in our mind and smaller number on our fingers. Yes. Which number is bigger number? Yes. Three number is bigger number. So we are keeping three number in your mind and we are doing two fingers and start counting after three, four, five. Yes. So here our answer is five hundred forty-three. Five hundred forty-three. So students, let's see more examples of three-digit numbers additions. Yes. So look here. One, two, and three. Three examples are there. So students, let's calculate. Number one. Hundred tens and ones. Yes. Because here the addition is of three digit numbers 321 plus 312 yes students the numbers are 321 plus 312 okay so let's calculate and as you are aware of that whenever we are starting calculation of addition and subtraction we are starting the counting with ones digit yes so here on the ones column One and two is there, right? One plus two. So keep two in your mind. Do one finger and start after counting two, three. Yes, two plus one, three. Then after next, two plus one. Yes, students here. Two plus one is there. Keep two in your mind. Do one finger and two plus one, three. Now here, students, three plus three. So keep first one in your mind, second three on your fingers. So start counting after three, four, five, and six. So here our answer is six hundred thirty-three. Six hundred thirty-three. Move to next number, second sum. Hundred times and ones. Five hundred thirty-two plus four hundred sixty-three. Yes, students. Thirty-two plus four hundred sixty-three. Look here for the ones column. Keep three in your mind. Ones keep three in your mind. Do two finger and start counting after three, four, five. Yes, students. Three plus two, five. Next, three plus six. Okay, so keep six in your mind. Do three fingers and start counting up to six. Seven, eight, and nine. Yes, nine. Then after five plus four, keep five in your mind. Do four fingers and start counting up to five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Yes, five plus four, nine. So here our answer is nine hundred ninety-five. Yes, so here our answer is nine hundred ninety-five. Then after next sum number three, our third sum hundred tens and ones four hundred seventy-three plus two hundred twelve. Yes, students, four hundred seventy-three plus two hundred twelve. Okay, so look here on the one side. Yes, about three. So keep three in your mind. You two fingers. Yes, start counting after three, four, five. Then after on the tens column, seven plus one. Which number is bigger? Yes, seven. So keep seven in your mind. Do one finger and start counting after seven. Seven plus one, eight. Yes. Then after here four plus two, so keep four in your mind to do finger and start counting after four, five, six. So students, your answer will be six hundred eighty-five. Yes, students, six hundred eighty-five. So students, I hope you have cleared the concept about additions.